Hello everyone! Welcome to our Let's Play series of StarCraft Brood War. This is Colonel RPG as usual, and I'm very happy that it chose to join me today, as I have basically won this, I think. Uh, now I have a fleet, a victory fleet. The tricky bit has been taken care of, and it was all down to actually defending against the people that were coming this way, and I think we did a very, very good job. Let's get these guys up here, because we're now gonna advance up through here. And we have already a defense over there, just in case they decide to wreck our day. Which is always something that uh, our enemies like to do. Of course, I need to be careful here for any transgressors. I don't think they're coming my way. Which is interesting. This is a, a weird setup. Oh, there they come. Okay. Have they come this way? No, they have not. Oh, they have. Okay, it's all good. That guy's going down. Okay, I'm taking a lot of damage. Be back. Oh, no, that's bad. That guy's going down. Now he goes. They move. Okay. That's good. Take it out. Take that guy out, so just because it's annoying me. Okay, take that one. Take that one. Take that one. Take more. Ooh, that guy! No! Murder! Murder! Ooh! Kill, kill, kill! Oh no, this guy's going down. It's always too late when I see him. Kinda looks like I lost somebody. Yeah, now that this is the guy. Guys, oh no! Oh, that's good. Okay, fall back. Fall back. We got a new carrier. Affirmative. Sounds good to me. We have done many bad things to them. Oh my god, I have so much money. Okay, that's not really a problem. Money. Can't shoot that guy. Can I? Come on. There we go. I hate those guys. Okay. Poof. That's how they go. Just puff. Uh, okay, so we need to kill our tannies. And that Aldaris, not our tannies. That's Aldaris. That's Aldaris as well. I'm willing to think, or I'm willing to bet, that all of them are fake. But you never know. You never know. Maybe it's the last one. Because, of course, they can make it like that. They can pretend that it's the last one. It's like they wait until you kill the last one and say, Oh, that was them. That was him. You killed him. No. Arg. Uh, and yes, that's that might be that might very well be the case. Uh, we're making some upgrades over here because we don't have a lot of armor plating, which actually kind of might be sort of damaging us for right now. But that's not. Oh, you're always at the front, aren't you? This guy's crazy. Okay, no, you're the one taking damage, and these guys don't have a lot of armor, so. Seriously, don't stand at the front! How hard can that be? Harder than it seems, apparently. Okay, we have an upgrade complete. That's gonna help, actually, a little bit. Not tremendously, but... A little bit. We have that. What is shooting at them? Oh, that... Okay, uh, they're making more. Okay. I know, I know, it's all fine. Okay, so they can't make anything else. On this base, anyway. There's still that guy. Okay, we're making another one. Let's say move down here. That sounds bad over there. They move. Start attacking the Reavers. They can be seriously problematic. Okay, and then he's attacking. Oh, that's bad. No, 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 no. Attack. Oh, that's bad. He's gonna die. I'm gonna lose him. Oh, they're not attacking the same side. Same guy. Lovely. Get back here. Okay, fall back. 
Uh, I'm gonna actually come back over here, but I'm gonna make shield batteries up front, because that's just easier. They're so slow! Okay. Yeah, you go, guys. Oh, look at him! Hi! Oh, you're going down. Are they going after Mike? I think they were going after my, my uh, carriers. I was gonna say cruisers. Carriers, they're cruisers, sort of. Okay, half of them didn't do what I wanted them to do. But, yeah, but sure. Not a problem. Let's see attack. Let's see attack, my guys. Yeah, those guys are really good. That's the downside of the Protoss, though, is that their armor can be very nice, but, uh... Their armor can be very nice, but they always have shields, and their shields are not upgraded. So you're always going to be dealing with the actual shields, and you can't fix anything. Man, those guys. Okay. Yeah, they didn't bring down the pylon, so we're good there. Okay. Yeah, I don't think I need to do that. Okay, I missed you. I apologize. Now let's get ready. Okay, so you guys... You guys stop over here. Vespian Geyser depleted. You guys get over here, even though I have no need for money r right now. It's all about messing with these guys. And killing that guy. Just that guy. It's all about that. Although I am complaining about how the Protoss works. But of course I'm fighting Protoss. So I, I do have an advantage here with the wall attacking un unupgraded. For the most part, anyway. Unupgraded. Armor. Ooh, that's bad. I don't know what to say here. But I need to push. We have a lot of them. Okay. That's going well. Okay. They move over there. I can make more. Make more. Doesn't matter. Sort of a backup. Ooh. Okay, that's gonna be bad. Is he coming after me? Not really, but it doesn't matter. Over there. Okay. I see them being attacked. Not a problem. I don't think they are getting any backup though. So. They are getting their guys out of here, though, but that's really irrelevant. Okay, I have you. Control one. Upgrade complete. And we have an upgrade, which means that is taken care of. So, they move right there. Oh, there's one of these guys. Can't even select <laughs> so many of these guys around. Okay. Yeah, they're pretty smart with attacking enemies rather than buildings first. That's something that's very important. Did you think I'd be caught so easily? No, no. Did you, Executor? No. You have only destroyed a phantom. Yeah. A phantom head. Okay. Ooh. Kill, kill, kill. Ooh. Those guys are really nasty. They will destroy me. Completely. Okay, that thing is disabled, but let's still kill it. That thing is not disabled. Let's get down here and recharge. Okay, now we're making more of these guys. Sounds good to me. And now we have a little bit of money over here. Mm, no crystals. Sure. Uh, okay, so... Ooh, who's that? I saw you. Hmm. I have you. Let's go. Okay. Next attack. Yeah, everybody's charged. Let's go over here. A move. Oh, it's these guys. Okay, so they'll know I'll be here. But they might not know where I am. They didn't even get to attack. 
The poor little guy. The poor little guy. Just a move right there. Ooh, lovely. Get yourself some of those interceptors. Okay. They do end up shooting the interceptors if they can't get to me. Which is kind of interesting. Ooh, that's nasty. What are you doing up there? Don't do no thing up there. Okay, I imagine this is going to be highly defended, but it's it seems like an easy entrance. Look at that. Just right there. Just need to break into... Ooh, look at that thing up there. Yeah, this looks very easy. I am betting it's not going to be. I know, I know. I know. Oh, don't kill that. Instructions. Okay. So just kind of want to make sure. I don't get attacked. No, kill that, kill that! Okay. Should be fine. No, no. He hasn't done a silent storm, panic storm, or whatever. We are being attacked, though. That's awesome. There's another guy. Again, Executor. You destroy only a simulacrum of myself. Simulacrum. You believe me to be a traitor, but it is you and the matriarch who will usher our race to oblivion. You know nothing. He knows nothing. He do just he just doesn't like Kerrigan. That's all. Okay. Affirmative. And uh, yeah, that was the easiest one. By attacking from there, of course. Maybe it was meant to be. Uh, it was, you know, meant to be attacked from the air, whereas the other ones are a little bit more vulnerable to other things. Okay. Now we haven't destroyed that, which means we're probably going to be attacked from behind as well. I need you guys to get back. No, no, that's terrible. They have? No, they haven't. It's not my warriors. It's the interceptors. Okay. Sounds good to me. Those guys are really not doing their job, though. Okay, get rid of that. Oh, no, that's bad. Okay. Sounds good to me. Being on the lookout here. See you. It takes so long to start attacking, but it's kind of weird. Well, there's another one. Dang it, I told you I was going to be attacked from the back. If it was somebody, it's not a problem. The fact that we have shields is also a good thing because they do regenerate, of course, by their own, by themselves. Oh, we should have done that. Never, never bring the interceptors back even to them. Okay, I'm just kind of hoping for a little bit of a... I don't know what they're doing with those guys. I don't like it. Sounds good to me. Oh, we don't have violence. Sure. They move. They move. Okay. Interesting that we don't tend to lose any interceptors, even though they do get shot a bunch of times. There's just so many of them that it's never focused. Okay, so that guy's gone. I saw maneuvering around. We could attack right there and right now, but I want to make sure these guys don't come back. Go, that thing is so down. Okay. Now you guys. Oh, he's gonna die. 
we haven't lost anybody. Oh no, well. Just seemed like they did, but. Oh, you cannot be there. Okay, I think this is kind of safe. Kind of safe. Let's get that guy done and let's attack. Is that it? Okay. Good. Let's see what if he, it is indeed the last one. Of course he's not going to be there. Affirmative. Oh. It is finished, Judicator. Surrender your remaining forces and join us in eradicating the Zerg. I would sooner die, Dark One, than tarnish the memory of Ayer by joining with you. Your fate was sealed the moment your matriarch allied herself with the Queen of Blades. Those of us still loyal to Ayer will never be slaves to Kerrigan and her broods. Alderis, be reasonable. Kerrigan has changed. She no longer seeks to enslave anyone. Do not force us to destroy you. You can no longer afford to be so naive, Artanis. While you were securing the crystals, I discovered that your matriarch has been harboring a dark secret. She has been manipulated by... I have no time for this. Kerrigan, what have you done? I just cleaned up your mess, Proto. Don't be so squeamish. Wretched creature. This was our Protoss matter. You had no right to interfere. Be gone from this world. You are no longer welcome among us. Fine. I've done what I came here to do. I've ensured the destruction of the renegade Cerebrates, and I used you to do it. Have fun, mighty Protoss. We'll be seeing each other again real soon. Who has manipulated her, though? I'm not really sure what he meant. I don't know. I don't know. I honestly don't know. Countdown. Main Protoss phase, the planet of Shakuras. This entire chain of events has been masterminded by Kerrigan. And we played right into her hands. Yes, we did, Artanis. Yet our course is set, nonetheless. Using the Temple's energies against the Renegade Zerg may accomplish Kerrigan's aims, but it is still our only chance of survival. And survive we will, my warriors. For too long have we labored in futile defense, as our enemies push us further and further away from victory. The time has come to let loose the full fury of our powers. Never again shall Shakuris be despoiled by the foul touch of alien species. These Zerg shall be the first to fall before us. Matriarch, I have served you for many millennia. I have always valued your wisdom and strength. Yet, lately, in your mind, I have sensed something that clouds your true spirit. Though Kerrigan has gone, I wonder if her treachery still remains. Be at ease, Zeratul. I am still the same Rashikal you have always known. These recent events have weighed heavily upon me, and I am wearied. But fear not. My warrior spirit will shine before you and light your path to victory. Indeed. The time for action is upon us. The crystals must be taken to the temple while the Zerg still muster their forces. I shall carry the Urash myself, while Zeratul handles the callus. Executor, you shall provide escort for Artanis and Zeratul as they make their way to the temple. God's willing, we will channel the energies of the Zelmaga and scour this world clean of the Zerg. Oh. Go now, my children, oh. and know that the survival of our entire race depends upon your actions. Oh. I know what this mission is. I know what this mission is. It's really tricky. When we bring the crystals to the temple, 
The Zerg will surely send all their legions to destroy you. You must be prepared to protect the temple itself from the swarm. Yep. Yep. We have a separated base. We have... These two guys separated, basically. Okay. Get yourself up there. Oh, I don't really know what I'm gonna do here. I don't know what I am gonna do. Let's pick another one. Usually it's that that we st need to start doing. Okay. Let's get these over there. Uh, so that goes right here. And I start doing that, and now we have another one. There. Okay. Oh, this is gonna be a, a... Where's my... There's no gas up here? Dang it. Okay. Yeah. Uh. Let's build... Yeah, we're... This is... Carrier food. Heaven, basically, forever. Uh... Okay, now you're doing that. I just must not stop producing these guys. Uh, we have plenty of. Stay your will. Okay. How many do we have up here? I need that. Put them down there. How many do we have down here? I need five. There we go. And then put them over there. Is that you, the one that's moving? Yes. Okay. And then we have another one. Right there. Okay. Next, um, uh, need to build that, build that. Uh, yeah, yeah, we should be okay to defend them against the first few, uh, first few coming. Right here. Uh, okay, start making that. If you could bring that down, that'd be fantastic. I don't think so, though. No. Okay. Okay. And then you. And then I need another one, and soon another one. I'm gonna need a fleet beacon. Of course. Build it right there, and then go back to work. Then you have that over there. Okay. Okay, now, if these guys attack up here, I'm definitely gonna be in trouble. So... I'll need another one of that, uh, and I'll not, I'm not really sure, I'm just doing so many things. Okay, then we have three of them over here, and then the rest of the stuff goes in there. Uh, and then I'm waiting for the fleet beacon to, to be ready. Okay, once that is done, basically I'm protecting this side, because this is going to be my main base. Oh, we don't have too many of them over, over here, and I still make them. Okay, pylons are going to be necessary. Let's make a few. Okay. And then make one of these guys right there and then hold back. Go over here. That thing is done, which is great. So we now can start making carriers. And this is gonna be number two. Carrier, get yourself over there and then I can move them around if I need to. There we go. So we started out in the previous mission we started with that that upgrade already. So that's what that was. That confused me. Um Okay, that's good, and then up here, we are, we have everybody making that. Okay, we're gonna need another, excuse the sneakly. Uh, should I make them all down here? I think so. We're gonna need another one of these. Right there. Uh, upgrade is almost done. I don't know where the guy is. Oh, right there. That's gonna be number three. We can send him over there. Sounds good. Uh, this upgrade and that upgrade sounds perfectly all right to me. This is gonna require a lot of gas, though, because we don't. Uh, of course, now we're gonna be starved for gas. So that's another reason why I don't want to make too many other things. Oh boy. Done. Okay. And then. I can make more pylons. Okay. Basically a pylon farm over here. Okay, so this... Okay, yeah. We're gonna be starved for gas. 
Upgrade complete. Definitely gonna be starved for gas. Okay, so now we have at least our uh, um, carriers working properly. And a little bit of an upgrade. Not amazing, but something. Then we might want to make a couple of these. So these guys, excuse the hiccup, up here as well. Look at that thing making shinies. Okay. And then we have our first carrier. Upgrade complete. And we have our first upgrade as well. So we can defend from this side. We're probably gonna need other stuff done, but for right now, I mean the we're probably gonna need the uh, the uh, what's the word? Observers pretty soon. So you start making that, and we're gonna wait until we have gas. I could wait for this as well. It's not that. So we're making these guys. Uh, ugh, yeah, there's no sense in upgrading them for right now. So basically, making sure. Have engaged the enemy. Okay. That's gonna go badly. Hold back. Hold back. Yep, starting to take damage already. That is bad. That's the best I can do. I should be fine. Yep, should be fine. Now we don't have any army up here, and they are attacking over here exclusively. That's interesting. Okay, so... Uh, I'm starved for gas, so I shouldn't be doing what I was about to do. Let's make one of these guys. Let's make the batter or the batteries right there. And then that. And then we're making you up here. We're gonna have some cannons over there for defense. Uh, we're gonna need more of you pretty soon. Yeah, we didn't lose too much there, so I'm just gonna wait. Uh, we're also gonna need more beacons, more pylons. So let's make them down here. What is this thing doing here? Okay, of course delaying the upgrades might be a bad idea, but whatever. You require more Vespine gas. I know, I know. Just keep at it. Good. We have our second one. And our third one. Lovely. Okay, so being fast is going to be important. I remind you, our objective is to protect the temple from the Zerg. That's going to be the, the biggest, the biggest single uh, challenge in this mission. But yeah, we're out of time for right now. So I'm Colonel RPG, and this has been StarCraft Brood War. I really hope you've enjoyed it, and if you did, go ahead and leave a comment. Like the video if you want to see the next episode come out sooner rather than later. But above all, thank you so much for watching. And I hope I'll see you next episode. Bye-bye.